Fork is you know down new and I would like to welcome you once again back to Indie Bites here on Pixel Attack. Today's game is Tiny and Big Grandpa's Leftovers by Black Pants Studios. This is a game all about doing stuff like this. You cut things and then you use your grappling gun to pull things. Or you can use your rocket to boost things and get them out of your way. And you do all sorts of those things to uh, <laughs> all sorts of those things. Use your tools to solve various platforming challenges, kind of like this one here. I probably didn't cut that enough. That's fine. Whatever. We're just going to lay another one on there. Yeah. Just like this. Uh, come on. Come on. You know what? That's actually probably not... No, that's not close enough. But we can just push this on over here. Oh, don't get smushed. So, platforming... Yeah, I'm good at platforming, guys. I, I swear I am. Let's see. There's a lot of <laughs> improvising that goes... Wow, that's just easier. I should just do that one from now on. It's it's all presented in a really, really awesome way. There's a great... Honestly, there's a really cute story to it. Um, the graphics are awesome. Like, I love this visual style. The music is also awesome. Let's go ahead and get you out of the way. And just on top of all of that the characters are the characters are just they're just great some of the puzzles are a little bit hard <laughs> Un unwieldy hard but I mean it's all it, there's nothing wrong with the hard puzzle. I, I honestly think that the difficulty is fine it's what it comes down to is sometimes the um, you, you die in one hit and sometimes it feels like you just kind of get unlucky, and this is not going to go it went the way. Oh, neat. Lucky me. Let's go ahead and cut that side off and get that out of here. Oh, nope. Didn't do that right. Like I said, there's there's a lot of, of improvised stuff going on in this game. Oh, yeah. And the jumping, the, the jumping is, a, it's, it's a little weird how precise it is, I guess. I don't know, I'm just, I've, I've played through the whole game and I'm still not entirely used to it. That said, it, it works. It's, it's seriously super duper fun to, to play. Um, I love doing this. Oh, that didn't work out right. Hang on. I love doing this. Woo! Just sending things off. <laughs> I got an achievement for that. Wow, fantastic. And in addition to all this, there there are plenty of just really, really awesome secrets hidden throughout the game. Let's see if I can show you one back there. A hidden music tape. I've already gotten them all. Not to brag, yes to brag. I'm bragging. I've gotten all the music tapes. Deal with it. There are hidden levels, hidden challenges, just all sorts of... All sorts of goodies. And then there's this jerk. This is big. He's the main antagonist. He stole our grandpa's pants. And we're chasing him down so we can get the pants back. The dialogue is... It's got some... I guess it seems like translation issues. Where just grammar's wrong in some points. Or things are worded really strange. But all in all, it just it just kind of helps add to the tone of the game. And and there's that sense of scale I mentioned earlier. Over there, that floating pair of pants, that's where we're headed. Well, right now we're headed up there, but eventually you go over there. And it's it's ridiculous. I love games where you can sort of see the journey out ahead of you. Like that. Let's go ahead and knock this thing over. Bam! That didn't do quite what I was expecting, but that's okay. I just grab this, bring it. Oh, it didn't cut all the way. Just, go, just grab this and bring it on over here. Give us a little bit of a platform. Jump on this. Jump on this. And jump on that. It didn't make it. Whatever. No big deal. No big deal. Yes, it's a big deal. Come on, just get over here. See, that's that's what I mean about the physics in this game are kind of weird. 
Um, I mean, I guess it makes sense, but it's just kind of silly. It works, though. It works. And that is actually all the time that we have for today. So once again, this was Tiny and Big Grandpa's Leftovers. You can find it on Steam. You can find a copy of it on the game's website, obviously. And that unlocks multi-platform. You can get it on Steam. You can get it on, uh, on GOG. And I believe it's even available on Amazon. So that's it. That's all I got for this episode. If you have any suggestions for games that I should feature on Indie Bytes, go ahead and just shoot me a tweet at ForkH on Twitter. You can also send me an email at uh, nevin at pixelattack.net. That's it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Further, Games.